Hello and welcome to today's video where we will look at an overview of the effects of coffee on the human body. Coffee is one of the most popular beverages in the world. It is estimated that over 2 billion cups of coffee are consumed every day. But what does coffee do to our bodies? In this video, we will explore the scientific effects of coffee. Coffee is made from the roasted seeds of the coffee plant. The most common species of coffee used for coffee production are coffee arabica and coffee robusta. These seeds contain various chemicals that affect the body and brain. One of the most well-known effects of coffee is its ability to increase alertness and concentration. This is due to the presence of caffeine, a natural stimulant found in coffee. Caffeine works by blocking the action of adenosine, a chemical in the brain that promotes sleep and suppresses arousal. When adenosine is blocked, other neurotransmitters like dopamine and norepinephrine are released, leading to increased energy, mood, and cognitive function. Several studies have shown that caffeine can improve various cognitive tasks, including reaction time, attention, and memory. However, the effects of caffeine can vary depending on the individual, their genetic makeup, and their tolerance to caffeine. For those who are sensitive to caffeine, decaf coffee is an alternative. Decaf coffee contains only a small amount of caffeine, about 2 to 5 mg per cup compared to 95 mg in a regular cup of coffee. However, coffee contains more than just caffeine. It also contains antioxidants and other bioactive compounds that can have beneficial effects on health. Some studies have suggested that regular coffee consumption may be associated with a lower risk of several chronic diseases, including type 2 diabetes, Parkinson's disease, and liver cancer. One of the most abundant bioactive compounds in coffee is chlorogenic acid. This compound has been shown to have antioxidant properties, meaning it can help protect cells from damage caused by free radicals. Coffee consumption has also been linked to a lower risk of depression and suicide. One study found that women who drank 2 to 3 cups of coffee per day had a 15% lower risk of depression than those who drank less than 1 cup per week. However, it's important to note that adding sugar and cream to coffee can negate some of its potential health benefits. High sugar consumption has been linked to various health problems, including obesity, type 2 diabetes, and heart disease. Additionally, some people may experience negative side effects from drinking coffee, such as insomnia, anxiety, and heart palpitations. Pregnant women are also advised to limit their caffeine intake, as high levels of caffeine have been linked to low birth weight and premature birth. In conclusion, coffee can have various effects on the body and it is important to understand the different effects to ensure a healthy body and lifestyle.